Something's about to happen. Oh. Goosebumps again. I think I'm a little wuss when it comes to these games. Hey, get up. <laughs> well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders Ugh. in your hair. But I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? Who's your daddy? Not her dad. Babe sleep. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're gonna no offense. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear it's the Probably enemy. a backhoe. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Dodging or quacking? <laughs> Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! See? The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. What, you think that's me? I'll ask the girl. I'll see what the girl would like. Ah. Gotta consult the missus. I understand. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. Scott is a very pretty mm, name. Thank you. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I wanna build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Kill! Cool. Duck and I will hop to it. <laughs> I can keep an eye on your little girl. Not my girl. Place. We can visit. Not my girl. Alright, let's see here. How do I use that walkie talkie? You have oh, thank you. Hair. It gets lots of tangles. Be sure to check in with everyone so far. Okay, uh, let's check in with. Can I go in the house? No, no, no. Alright, let's go check in over here. Oh, there they are. All the way back here. Sean's still working on that fence. Yeah, I see that. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Yeah, I'm not really the handyman he type of guy. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him hmm. right in the face. Headshot. Shit, Dan. <laughs> he didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes. You gotta do what you gotta do. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh... Yep. Sometimes I kill a bastard poor girl's brains in. Bastard. Poor girl's brains. Well, I couldn't do that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My parents are making. I don't know where my ex-wife is. Uh... I'm not quite sure where my ex-wife is. Ah. Oh. Yeah. For huh? Sure. What do you mean by that? That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. Do 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 do. Do you uh, think this thing will keep him out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. If you say so. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. <laughs> Farm Bill. <though>. I'm good. <laughs> How are these things to drive? Awesome! Pain in the ass, mostly. 
big, heavy as hell, and slower than uh, molasses. He is having a jolly old time. Oh, I hit the wrong button. I meant to talk to him. How you doing, Duck? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with <laughs> Oh, come on, I keep hitting the wrong one. How you doing? No. Good. Right. I'm going to drive the tractor. Live with your back, Sean. All right, I thought he was going to say something different. Let's ask one more time about this fence. Nope. All right, I guess he... All right. We'll keep him out. Oops. Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll so I guess even if I can click on it, there's not all that many choices all the time. Alright, let's go check in with the other folk. It seems like an alright dude. Kenny. Dude, where's your car? Hey there. Kenny. Kenny Powers. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. Oh. I'm, a I'm on a boat. Catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Uh, I don't really want to help you, but I'll ask. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? Well, I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I have no idea, man. I have no idea what I'm doing. At least you're honest. Shit. Better than I was when Duck showed up. <laughs> when Duck out. showed up. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But... We're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. See you. Hmm. Hmm. Nothing. Oh, oh, I thought that was a walker in there. It's just Herschel, I think. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Katya. Do you have to go to the bathroom or anything like that? Lee, the young woman can take care of herself. <laughs> okay. Hey there, girl. You two actually look real relaxed. What do you do? How was the city? How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some just. Just... Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow. But even then... Yeah, I you're not going home. The things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Mm. That was pretty bad. Things were bad before. Bad now, but they're different, you see? People are don't you see his handcuff them, marks? But they weren't before. The bad. The politics, the, the <laughs> those things are gone. Hell comes in a lot of different. It's true. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale, like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats, and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. 
Uh, yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. easy. Well, yeah. So, you good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful. Mm, no. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. I learned Clementine as a first grader. Let's go check in with him. What's up, Herschel? You should know that if you weren't leaving with Penny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I'm not sure I follow. A man asks you your name, you give it. <laughs> that name is no good. How'd you get out of that land? That's funny. I didn't want to give him my name, bro. I was on my way out anyway. The timing of all this just happened to be right. Huh. If there ever is a good time for the supposed apocalypse. This farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. <laughs> Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? I murdered them all. Girlfriend? Mm, my parents... No family. No family. I had a beta fish on my desk at the university. I hope someone remembered to feed him. But now you've got this little <laughs> girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Well, I mean, yeah, it's freaking zombie apocalypse. What are you getting at? Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Mind your own business. Mind your own business. I don't know who you are or what you did, but you better become a better liar than fast. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. So whoever you are and whatever you did, keep it to your damn self. Oh, and trying to be less of an asshole would serve you just fine. No, I'm gonna keep being an asshole. Go! I'll get my 